I was, I was ah! So, uh, morning from sunny Yorkshire. It's not that sunny, really. Um, funny night's sleep last night. My air mattress went down, so it was really hard. <laughs> uh, I've kept disturbing Lizzie all night, so she hasn't slept much. I actually feel quite good. We haven't eaten yet. It's, what's the time? It's uh, it's up us yeah it's up us ten. A lot of people on this site are going home. Um, got, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, we've had a cup of tea. I'm charging up loads of stuff. I've got, got that big battery charger. Lizzie's got to charge her arm up, which is uh, on the bike at the moment. <laughs> Look. A lot of people have difficulty charging their GoPros, and oh, I could smell food. Oh, oh man! Smell. What? Skunk. We can smell marijuana, or whatever you call it in slang terms. Um, we had the packet meals last night. Uh, Got to be honest, that's about as. Mm, mm. It's like, get away, fly. The fly. <laughs> what? Well, no, it's gone. So the packet meal was a. I would say that was a. Get away. I would say that was a. I, I was. Ah! Sure. I, I was. Ah! I, I was. Ah! Sorry. What are you doing? <laughs> <Can't> fly. <laughs> She's been wanting to do that all night, I reckon. <laughs> I know I'm a pain, but bloody hell. <laughs> I didn't mean it. Hmm. It was funny though, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I have a big rib mark on my this neck is, now. This is how we're going to sleep tonight. <laughs> <laughs> just, just so you can find me. <laughs> that it looks work? a bit weird. Do you work? Yeah. Yeah, it does actually. You yeah, switch look. it on. It's glowing. <laughs> I'll have to find you in the night time. No, you can't see it. Look, there's that fly again. Look, basket. Right, fuck off. What's the matter with it? It's after, it's after me Osmo. Right, what was I going to say? Right, we've got no breakfast. We've got nothing to eat today. Um, so we're going to have to find something. The lady who owns the site, we were talking to her yesterday. She said she might have some eggs for us. So I've got to go and look for the eggs. Um, if we can find some bacon or something, that would be great, but I don't think we're going to. Uh, so, like, eggs for breakfast, that's it. Yeah, we're probably going to have about four. Yeah, four so at the most. I'll get one. <laughs> <laughs> so if we get four eggs, I'll have three and Liz will have one. But we're scrambling them all up. Scrambled heads. Um, I've still got to uh, seal off the Trangia. I haven't attempted that yet. Um, you have to have this knack around the campsite, I'm noticing that be careful where you put things because you knock things over like that. So it's really getting used to being organised. But Lizzie's done a really good job in the tent. She organises it all, then I go in there and fry it all around <laughs> everywhere. I mean, this morning, for Christ's sake, her mother's ashes were in a container in my freaking bed. <laughs> Yeah, she has them on a necklace. That's because I had them in my pocket, all right, here, and you were f kicking about and pulling the quilt off me. So as you pulled the quilt, yeah. you've pulled my trousers. Yeah, I pulled it over me. And it out when you're the other side. So mm. don't worry, my mum didn't get in between <laughs> Thank God. It was funny though. I did laugh. <laughs> yeah, so don't know what we're going to do today. We might go out for a ride. We've decided because yesterday was such a difficult day. And this is why it was a difficult day. I just want to explain it to you, right? So 
first thing in the morning, eight o'clock in the morning, we're in a hotel and we've got to get up to buy Oasis tickets, right? <laughs> so that was really, really important. Which we were successful in. Which we were successful in and it took us a good couple of hours um, on, on the uh, computer try, trying to get these tickets, but we got tickets. So we are absolutely stoked for that, for Wembley next August. Cannot wait. Um, it's going to be a great birthday present for me, put it that way. Thanks to Lizzie. Oh, it's a birthday present for you. Yeah. And then... Alfie and Frankie's going, so we're going to have some fun. Um, don't think anyone else likes the Oasis, don't get anyone else to uh, go out of them. So then what we had to do, we had to pack up our car with all our clothes and all the stuff that we're sort of on the road with at the moment. Because we are still we, homeless. Because we are still homeless, yeah, and we had to take all of that to our lock-up and then we had to get all of our bike gear and camping gear and take it from that lock-up into the lock up where the bikes are and then we had to put everything onto the bikes and then we could get going so we didn't end up getting going until about but two o'clock we couldn't get going because you picked up your boots and you picked up odd boots oh uh, yeah so <laughs> i'd gone to the lock up i picked up my motorbike boots gone to the lock up where the bikes are and i've got two pairs of different brown boots that look similar and I picked one of each up you, I reckon you could have got away with it no they were the same foot <laughs> so right. I had to go back to the lock up again and get that oh and find Lizzie's batteries for her Osmo because she'd lost them so no found no them. no no you I put them in your were. camera bag I told you exactly where they were you just couldn't find where my camera bag was because I put it away tidy yeah so we had to do that and then we got on the road and I wanted to go all the way through the, um, oh, I wanted to go through the Lincolnshire Wolds which is really, really beautiful, then across the Humber Bridge and then up into South Yorkshire and what blooming happens is... My sat-nav told us to go that way and yours said a different uh, way. I just, I, this, my sat-nav said, said a different way and I'd, I'd set it to go that way, the way I wanted it to go and for some reason it took me all the way up the A1. So Lizzie and I just had a horrible ride. Well, it wasn't a bad ride. It was a good ride, but it's just like no fun, is it, being on the A1, like for like 100 miles. It's, it's horrible. But um, yeah, so, but we got here, you know, and we're happy. And uh, we've got to try and get Lizzie some sleep tonight. And we've got to try and get some eggs. And we've got to pay. Right? I think I was up at about... I'll pass two looking for a cottage to stay in. And then I got up at I bus four for a pee. Right. And then I got up at six o'clock because although that's blackout, I saw the sun rising. So yeah, all in all, not a great night's sleep. As you can tell. We might go to a hotel tonight. No. No, we tomorrow. Won't. Tomorrow. No, no, don't. Go to another campsite? Yeah. It's gonna be raining. Well, We'll have to be stuck in there then, won't we? In where? <clears throat> in the tent. Yeah, but well, we've got to pitch up in the rain. Well, you best get your raincoat on then. <laughs> I'll help you. I just thought that we could have one night in a hotel while it's raining and then go to a campsite. No, we're going to pitch up in the rain. Okay. All right. Let's uh, look forward to that then. <laughs> so that's where we are now. So yeah, I want to go and find some eggs and see if I can cook some breakfast. Uh, oh, I've learned how to fly, fly my little X1 hover. Oh, that is awesome. I love that. Lizzie did it as well. It's something, and I can do it with my arm as well. So yeah. I would recommend that. Yeah. It's a really good drone for anyone to use. Yeah, I know. So we've got our little drone and it's just a tiny little thing. You press the buttons on it and it follows you around and does what you need to do. So we look forward to seeing what the footage and that's like from that, don't we, Liz? We do. Yes? <laughs> right, I'm going to put this down. My legs are aching. I wonder if my solar battery thing or my solar charger will work. I hope so, because I need to charge my arm. Yeah. Will it plug into that? Yeah, the uh, bike one will, won't it? Yeah, I should I think. think so. <laughs>
So it's the second meal I've ever cooked in the Trangia. What was the first one? What did we cook last night? Slop. What did we cook last night, Liz? Slop. And what was it? Slop. Ah, okay. So last night's meal wasn't a proper meal because it all came in a package. So tonight I'm cooking Chinese chicken and, uh, well, chicken and Chinese spices. And uh, we've got a salad to have that with some rice. So... The first real meal deal. Neil's real meal deal. Neil's real meal deal. It's real and it's from Neil and it's my meal deal. That was good. The ground's a little bit uneven. Liz is like the teenager. Not exactly the most stylish cuisine, but a bit of salad with it, chicken, rice, all good. Beverage of the night is a doom bar. Beverage of the night? Sprite. Sprite. This has got the Sprite, I've got the doom bar. It's getting late, it's about quarter to eight now. We've had our evening meal. And it's starting to get dark. I've got to go and wash it up. No one ever shows you what it's like after you've had your food. And you've got to do the really naff bit, which is all the cleaning up. Look at this. Yep, there's Lizzie. Say hi, Lizzie. Hi. Are you going to clear all this up? Absolutely. Thank you. Right, yeah, we're going to go and clean all this up now, all this mess. And then uh, we were just saying, actually, normally we don't go to bed till about 12 in the evening, something like that, sometimes later. And uh, now we're turning in about 9 o'clock. A few days in the countryside and you start to feel really tired. Where we've been so hectic for the last God knows how many months, probably six months, isn't it, Liz? Mm. The last six months have been pretty crazy for us. And now we're just like slowing down. Oh, the other thing we were talking about was whether or not it's worth going down into Spain and Portugal in November, December sort of time. Uh, let's know what you think. 
Maybe, I don't know so much. Is it better to go hotels, Airbnbs, better to camp? Uh, like I say, November, December, January, February sort of time. Is that a good time to go down into Spain and Portugal? Um, yeah, I don't want to be sleeping in sub-zero temperatures because it's not really any fun in your <laughs> no, 50s, really. No, enough now. The mist over there. Yeah. It's, like... it's quite misty in Yorkshire tonight. Fortunately, the weather weren't great today, so, you know, us being fair weather riders, we didn't do that much. Um might be different if we had different types of bikes but thanks for watching the video guys and uh we'll see you tomorrow when we're heading up north okay are we going up north mm -hmm. yeah we're going up north tomorrow when things are going south we're going north yeah so we have a saying when things are going south we're heading north take care stay safe look after each other and uh we'll see you on the next one Country roads take me home. Go on then, it's fun. To the place <laughs> I belong, West Virginia, Mountain Mama, take me home. Them country roads. Your turn. Good night, everybody. Oh, sing. Don't be boring. Boring. You are. I'm sing. responding to our friends. What friends? Um, uh, socials. <laughs> <laughs> right. That's it. See you tomorrow. <laughs>